Hi folks, um, as you know by now I'm always one for keep um, keeping it real and, and sharing the reality so I debated whether to send this photo on what should be like a happy celebration day but like I feel like we should keep showing the real story um, and both sides of it especially in this social media world we live in. Um, so long story short, um, it's mine and my wife's 10th wedding anniversary today which is amazing um, but the reality is I've been struggling all week um, with pain. I didn't sleep at all, really, Wednesday night. Managed to get through work yesterday, um, even though I'd been up since 2am. And it finally caught up with me last night. Um, I know it's not just pain, it's my resilience as well, because I have a procedure on my foot on Sunday at the hospital. I'm having that injected and scanned and... And next week I've got um, an abdomen scan as well for something else that's going on that hopefully will give us some answers. So I've got a lot on my mind and, and I find when I have a lot on my mind that impacts my ability to cope with my pain. So sometimes the pain doesn't change, but as I often say, my ability to cope with it does. So um, so firstly, I should probably say a massive thank you to all the lovely comments and everything on social media for, for the anniversary celebrations and everything. But the reality of it is, is that, and I'm going to try and not get upset because those of you who know me now know I'm a bit of an emotional mess. Um, the reality is, is that tonight we were supposed to be going to a restaurant because my son wanted us to spend our anniversary together. Um, and I can't do that now. I'm not at work now today. I tried and failed this morning. Um... So I can't go to a restaurant tonight. That, that just wouldn't sit well with me. And, you know, we'll have a takeaway and we'll find ways around it and everything else. But, you know, this 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 idea that, you know, because I put a happy post on social media that I'm coping and I'm managing and everything's going fine and, and I have had my fair share of DMs from people saying, well, you're doing fine. How, you know, what gives you the right to talk about limb of this condition? And... But the reality is I'm here <laughs> on my bed um, in pain, um, carrying a bit of a mental burden. But more importantly, when my son comes home from school today, I have to explain that we can't go for that family meal. We told him we would. Um, and we have to adapt and adjust and make compromises. And that's all because of my pain, um, that my family has to make compromises and adapt and adjust. Um, so I just wanted to share that. I'm not. It's not meant to be a negative thing. I don't want to take away from the fact that it's amazing. My wife and I have been married for 10 years. And she's an absolute rock, by the way, guys. For those of you who aren't aware, she moderates all the Facebook groups, channel, the Discord servers, the live streams, both live streams on YouTube and on the podcast, Twitch. Um, yeah, she does loads behind the scenes. She was also a big part in me setting up Charity Sorratic Disease UK earlier this year. She's an absolute hero. Um, and yeah, you know, so we put these things on social media. It's amazing. And everyone's happy and I'm, I'm really grateful for all the, all the comments. But the reality is we're not doing nothing for our anniversary today because my chronic illness and my pain decided earlier this week it was going to stop me from sleeping. Um, and therefore it then breaks me and my ability to cope with it i'm still hoping we can do something tomorrow i'll um, put something on socials if there is a happy ending to this <laughs> i'm sure there will be um but i just wanted to get that across and just share how you know the reality of living with these conditions means a birthday isn't always a birthday you know it was my 40th earlier how can you plan how can you plan doing anything when this is your life, you know, and then on Sunday, I've got to go and have a load of needles stuck in the bottom of my foot and I might not be able to walk next week. So who knows what next week looks like and who knows what the week after that looks like. So it's rough. The mental burden is real. And ultimately, I'm here to share that um, both sides of the story. But ultimately, it's a day of celebration. We are very happy. Thank you for all your lovely comments. It's not to take the shine off any of that. Um, but yeah. It doesn't mean it's not going to suck when come four o'clock this evening I have to sit down with my son and say we're not going to his favourite restaurant um, but instead we'll try and make do with a takeaway at home and a movie or whatever. Um, but that is the reality of chronic illness. Enjoy your Friday guys, have a great weekend and thank you for all your lovely comments on social media today, I really appreciate it.